played four games so far yeah. this year. How have you felt about the start of the season? Um, you know, definitely excited about it. Um, I think it was a good start for us. Um, you know, coach made an emphasis about, you know, playing four quarters. Um, and, you know, we're a quarter away through the season. So definitely just trying to keep it up, um, you know, sustain throughout the whole season and, and expect big things out of us. Last year, a lot of people talked about your transition from Tennessee to Alabama, starting yeah. to learn the Alabama way. Now that you've had a full off season back off that season as well, just yeah. how has it felt getting ready for this year? Um, you know, it's been it's been a blessing, honestly. Um, just being able to be under Coach Saban's wing, um, learn his ways, learn why you know this place is so special, um, and you know, honestly, got comfortable, comfortable with the guys, comfortable with the scheme, the coaches, um, and I think the guys, you know, they gained my trust, and, and this has been a huge blessing for me. How competitive is that linebacker room right now? Um, you know, it, it's so competitive. You know, every every single day we're out competing for a job. Um, but you know, I think the the camaraderie that we have in that room is is the biggest part of it. Um, we want each other to succeed as much as we can and, and see the best out of everybody. You know, I love each and every one of those guys in that room. Um, those are my dogs for so. But um, you know, we're, we're we're some big competitors in there. Keeping teams out of the end zone once they reach the red zone has been a big point of emphasis, certainly helped in the win against Texas. We've yeah. seen that in the games here as well. Just what have you guys talked about when it comes to red zone defense? Um, you got to buckle up. And, and that's where you know defenses are made, and that's where you you create your identity as a defense is is when your back's against the wall and they're about to score. Um, so that's kind of been one huge part of our our defense this off season was red zone efficiency. So being able to stop them to a field goal, um, create a turnover and stuff like that. So um, that's been huge for us. Um, you know, this is just stacking it now. You know, doing it over and over again and, and preventing those guys from scoring. Now you're getting ready to play Arkansas again. What do you remember about last year's Arkansas game and their quarterback, KJ Jefferson? Yeah, um, that was definitely one of those close games. It came down to the wire, one of those last drive kind of games. Um, you know, KJ Jefferson was a huge part to their success, and, you know, he's a great quarterback. And um, expect big things out of him, expect a big game plan for him. Um, you know, he's huge, can make a, a lot of throws, and can run the ball. Um, so, you know, it's just about, you know, playing fundamental football, um, having gap integrity, and doing stuff like that. So, it'll be huge. And the Crimson Tide playing their Arkansas Razorbacks on the road in Fayetteville. Do you like playing in a tough road environment? Oh, 100%. 100%. You know, one, one of our main goals is emptying the stadium before the game is done. So that's one of the main reasons why, you know, your back's against the wall. Nobody wants you to win. So that's one of the main reasons why I like playing on the road. We look forward to Saturday. Henry, thank you for joining us. Roll Tide. Roll Tide.